The Trax Reticular Lighting System is an incredible product line from Evolite. One of the leading features of Trax is how simple it is to install. In this video, we will discuss the basic system configuration. Trax is a 24 volt DC constant voltage lighting product. Each 24 by 96 inch Trax array has been designed to maximize a 24 volt 96 watt class two circuit, utilizing only 86 watts. This design factors in headroom for power supplies to operate efficiently, therefore minimizing operational downtime due to power supply failures. There are a massive number of control options available in the market. These will have different capabilities and integration requirements. Therefore, we recommend that you work with your Evolite Systems Integration Specialist to find the control solution that will best fit your needs. Now that you understand some of the requirements, let's discuss building a Trax reticular lighting system. At the most basic level, a Trax system is comprised of three components. A power supply, light control, and Trax array. First, ensure that all power is disconnected at the source. Next, make the connection from the output side of the power supply to the input side of the control. Next, make the connection from the output side of the control to the Trax array using the included WEGO connectors. Trax single color white and single color white with lens use the typical two wire connection. The gray stripe wire is positive while the white wire is negative. Trax Tunable White is a two-channel product that uses three wires. The black wire is positive. The white wire controls the cool white LED channel, and the yellow wire controls the warm white LED channel. Proportionally mixing these channels creates the adjustable white range of 2700K warm white to 6500K cool white. Trax RGBW is a four-channel product and uses five wires. The black wire is positive. The other four wires are color-coded according to the LED channel they control. For example, the blue wire controls the blue LED channel and the white wire controls the white LED channel. It's a good idea to completely unroll the Trax array, making sure that the three unused lead wires of the array do not come into contact with any conductive surfaces, including the array itself. Last, give your setup a final inspection, ensuring all wires are secured and then reconnect power at the source to test the functionality of your product.